Bigger, better, and modern. All part of the city's plan to give the Blaisdell Center a much needed facelift. But once the work begins, expect some changes. The city wants to turn the Blaisdell Center into Honolulu's gathering place. It's a $400 million renovation project. Officials say the current Blaisdell Center is outdated and changes will be made so it's on the same level as other civic centers. Improvements include more parking spots, new retail space like restaurants, a modernized arena, and a bigger concert hall. Bridget Nomada looks ahead. Joe, the city tells me renovations won't start until 2019 at the earliest, but it's starting a conversation for those who use the space. Some users may get accommodated, others, unfortunately, will not. The Blaisdell Center was built in the 1960s. <laughs> It's been the venue for concerts, farmers markets, and graduations throughout the years. But the director of the Department of Enterprise Services tells me it's time for a change. It actually served our community exceptionally well over 50 years, but we're ready to move forward. This is the 21st century, and we need a 21st century facility for our community. The Hawaii Symphony Orchestra agrees the Blaisdell needs the upgrade but it worries the projected two-year renovation project will be catastrophic for the nonprofit. Right now, the, 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 most of the plan is focused on the facilities and how best to accomplish those changes. Part of it needs to also be sensitivity to the users that are so reliant on the venue. What's being done to accommodate users of the venue that will be impacted? And the first thing we did was, was to have a meeting. We, put, we invited our, our, our key users, those groups who have traditionally been there. We call them our anchor tenants like the symphony and the opera theater. We've got, we brought promoters in, folks who are there on a routine basis, exhibitors, and we allow them to meet with the um, consultants. Kaulu Kukui tells me the city is working with consultants to come up with the best way to handle the renovations, through phases or altogether. But there is one group of users that will have to find a new alternative. Area employees use the Blaisdell's parking structure. Several workers at nearby Straub Hospital, Queens Medical Center, and Hawaiian Electric tell me it will be hard to find a new place to park because it's hard enough to find parking in town. That would probably be the, the one that's the most difficult to avoid because there is a period of time where the parking structure will be unavailable at all. It, it, it truly does need to come down, um, so not only so that we can expand, so that we can improve the flows through the parking structure. Since the, since the renovations are in its early design stages, the city says it wants to hear from the public. The next public meeting will be held in June. Live from the Blaisdell, Bridget Namata, KHON 2 News.